effective in so many ways. Dribbles once, and then puts it up and in. Bridges, nice catch. Oh! Whoa! That's why they like him. Hart on the wing, full to shoot. Hart to the bucket. We played for the ones that came before us. They set the tone. This is on us to keep the tradition, man. And I just, I just love these guys. I just love them. Love them to death. It finally happened. With the New York Knicks trading for Mikel Bridges, the Nova Knicks are now fully assembled and officially complete. Mikel Bridges is now paired with Jalen Brunson, Josh Hart, and Dante DiVincenzo, who were all teammates in college at Villanova. While many NBA fans view this move as fun more than anything, this move legitimately puts the Knicks in championship contention, and by far the biggest threat to the Boston Celtics in the Eastern Conference. This move doesn't just build immediate chemistry, it fundamentally reshapes the team's offensive and defensive dynamics, inserting an elite two-way wing to an already stacked roster. We know amongst the Nova guides that Jalen Brunson is an elite scorer, Dante is a great shooter, and Josh Hart has the heart and hustle. But how does Mikel come in and contribute right away? How well will this roster fit together, and how good are the Nova Knicks actually? Let's break it all down. Bridges' reunion with Brunson, Hart, and DiVincenzo is not just a sentimental reunion, but a calculated strategy to leverage their established chemistry. Even coach Jay Wright is loving the pairing, showing some love on Twitter after the move. And looking back, this quartet was instrumental in Villanova's 2016 and 2018 NCAA championship runs, and their synergy is expected to translate seamlessly on an NBA roster. The familiarity and camaraderie among these players can significantly bolster the Knicks' on-court and off-court chemistry, which will only help this team improve. But let's quickly talk about the impact that Mikel Bridges brings to this Knicks squad. One of the most significant impacts Bridges brings to the Knicks is his defensive versatility. Known for his exceptional perimeter defense, Bridges finished second in the Defensive Player of the Year voting in 2022, highlighting his elite defensive skills. His 7'1 wingspan and instinctive help defense make him a formidable opponent for any scorer. In a team coached by Tom Thibodeau, renowned for his defensive strategies, Bridges is expected to thrive and possibly return to his peak defensive form, which had somewhat diminished during his time with the Nets, where he had to take on the primary offensive load. The pairing of Mikel Bridges and OG Ananobi is a defensive wing duo that is arguably the best in the league and is currently the best solution in the NBA for stopping the best overall wing duo in the league and Jason Tatum and Jalen Brown. This pairing, in theory, is built to stop both Tatum and Brown in the playoffs. On the offensive side of the ball, Bridges adds a new dimension to the Knicks. While he had to assume a primary scoring role with the Nets, averaging 26.1 points per game immediately after his trade from the Suns, he can revert to a more balanced role with the Knicks. His ability to play off the ball, coupled with his excellent three-point shooting, 37.5% career average, will provide much-needed spacing for Jalen Brunson, OG Ananobi, and Julius Randle. This spacing is crucial for the Knicks' offensive schemes, allowing their primary scorers more room to operate and reducing defensive pressure. He also can come in and be a primary offensive focal point when the load needs to be taken off of Brunson or Randall at times if they're struggling to find their rhythm late in games. Before we continue on, I wanted to quickly shout out today's video sponsor, Magic Spoon Cereal. Growing up, cereal was one of the best parts of my day, but as I got older, I realized it no longer fit my lifestyle. But with Magic Spoon, I'm finally able to enjoy one of my childhood favorites again. Magic Spoon is cereal reinvented. It has the same great taste that you remember, but upgraded with grown-up ingredients with no artificial flavors or dyes. Magic Spoon is a high-protein, keto-friendly, and naturally-flavored cereal that gives you the energy you need to tackle your day. 
Magic Spoon has 0 grams of sugar, 4 to 5 grams of net carbs, 13 to 14 grams of protein, and only 140 calories per serving. And the Magic Spoon Variety Pack comes in four delicious flavors, fruity, frosted, cocoa, and my personal favorite, peanut butter. Click the link below to grab a variety pack and try it today. Use the promo code DUNGEON at checkout to get $5 off any order. Or go to magicspoon.com slash dungeon. And the best part? Magic Spoon is so confident in their product, it's backed with a 100% happiness guarantee. If you don't like it for any reason, they'll refund your money, no questions asked. Click the link below or scan the QR code on the screen and use the code DUNGEON for $5 off. Start your day right with Magic Spoon. Another huge factor that Bridges has been praised for is his remarkable durability. Having never missed a game in his career, he currently holds a streak of 474 consecutive games played. This level of reliability is invaluable for a Knicks team that severely struggled with injuries late in the season. With Mitch and Randall not playing in the playoffs and OG missing almost all of the Pacers series, locking in Mikel Bridges ensures a consistent presence in the lineup and reduces the team's dependency on less durable players. This durability, combined with his all-around skill set as a two-way wing, makes Bridges a cornerstone piece for the Knicks' championship aspirations. There's no denying that the trade to acquire Bridges was a great move, but it was not without challenges. The Knicks had to navigate the complexities of dealing with the Brooklyn Nets, their crosstown rivals who were initially reluctant to part with Bridges unless they received an offer they could not refuse. The trade package that Brooklyn was offered included Bojan Bogdanovic and five first-round picks, a deal that Brooklyn simply couldn't refuse. The Knicks are in win-now mode and are committed to bolstering their roster to compete with the Boston Celtics as soon as next season. Another factor to consider within this trade is that trading for Mikel Bridges would strain the Knicks' salary cap, making it harder to re-sign Isaiah Hartenstein. Bridges' substantial contract could push the Knicks into luxury tax territory, forcing tough financial decisions. Additionally, prioritizing Bridges might reduce emphasis on retaining a backup center like Hartenstein. The need to balance roster depth and maintain future flexibility would further complicate re-signing Hartenstein, and the Knicks might prefer to preserve cap space for other opportunities or cheaper alternatives in the market. Looking ahead, the Knicks are poised for a promising 2024-2025 season, and with the addition of Bridges combined with their existing talent on the roster, the Knicks are positioned to be a very strong contender in the Eastern Conference. This move by the Knicks management demonstrates a willingness to make the bold move, indicating that they are not content with mere playoff appearances, but are aiming for championship contention. With Bridges in the fold, the Knicks lineup boasts remarkable depth and versatility. The potential starting lineup of Jalen Brunson, Mikel Bridges, OG Ananobi, Julius Randle, and Mitchell Robinson offer a blend of offensive firepower and defensive tenacity both on the perimeter and in the paint. Brunson's leadership and scoring ability paired with Ananobi and Bridges' two-way versatility is what Knicks fans are absolutely raving about. This duo forms a defensive tandem that can lock down opposing wings and guards, creating significant challenges for any offensive unit. And not to mention a healthy Julius Randle to add some offensive scoring threat and a healthy Mitchell Robinson as a paint protector truly leaves no holes in the Knicks roster. And of course, we can't forget about the bench, featuring Dante DiVincenzo and Josh Hart, who both play with a tremendous amount of passion, heart, and hustle. Dante will provide additional scoring, while Hart contributes anywhere in every way, being the anchor that ensures that the team can maintain its intensity throughout the game. And while we're all excited about the players, Thibodeau's preference for a switch-heavy defensive scheme aligns perfectly with the skill sets of Bridges and Ananobi, allowing for seamless transitions and matchup flexibility. This strategic depth is crucial for navigating the grueling NBA season and making a deep playoff run.
Bridges' leadership qualities and professionalism add another layer of value to the Knicks. His experience and winning mentality from his college days at Villanova, coupled with his time in the NBA, make him a respected figure in the locker room. This leadership can help guide younger players and foster a culture of accountability and hard work, which is essential for sustained success. Off the court, Bridges' return to play alongside his former college teammates has brought a whole new level of energy to an already energized Knicks fanbase. The story of the Villanova reunion resonates with fans, creating a narrative of camaraderie and unfinished business. This emotional connection can drive fan engagement and support, creating a vibrant atmosphere at Madison Square Garden and contributing to the team's home court advantage. The acquisition of Mikel Bridges is a pivotal moment for the New York Knicks. His defensive prowess, offensive versatility, durability, and leadership qualities make him the perfect addition to this team. Combined with the existing talent and the strategic depth of the roster, the Knicks are well positioned for a successful 2024-2025 season and beyond. The Villanova reunion not only strengthens the team's on-court performance, but also enhances fan engagement and community support, creating a holistic environment for success. As the Knicks aim for their first championship since the early 1970s, the addition of Bridges could be the catalyst that propels them to their first championship appearance in 25 years, and their first championship in over 50 years. But what are your thoughts on the move? Do you think adding Mikel Bridges makes the Knicks a legit title contender? Let us know in the comments below.